Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to share with you how to make some delicious machaca breakfast burritos. So if you're ready, let's get started. Okay guys, so first we're going to begin by cooking our beans. I'm going to be using my Instant Pot. So we're going to add one pound of beans, make sure that they're nice and clean. So that we're going to cover them with eight cups of water. Okay, so we're going to close it. Make sure that it's set on ceiling. We're going to be using the bean setting and we're going to allow our beans to cook for 40 minutes. Okay guys, so after 40 minutes, our beans are done. So now we are ready to cook our machaca. Okay guys, so to make our machaca, we're going to grab a frying pan. We're going to set it on medium heat and we're going to add four tablespoons of olive oil. So we're just going to wait for our oil to heat up. Okay, so once oil is hot, we're going to add half of a small white onion and two jalapenos. Along with two small potatoes. And now we're going to season with salt and black pepper. Going to mix it and allow them to cook for about five minutes. And of course, just make sure that you cut your potatoes into small pieces so like that they cook faster. Okay guys, so after five minutes, we're going to add in our machaca. And this is the one that I'm using. You can find it at your local meat market or at any Hispanic store. So we're just going to throw it in. And we're going to mix it with the potatoes, onions, and peppers. And now we're just going to continue to cook it for about seven minutes. And once you mix it, the meat is going to absorb all of the oil. So we're just going to add a little more. So just continue to cook. Okay, so after seven minutes, we're going to add two Roma tomatoes. Make sure that they're nice and chopped. And we're going to cook for one minute. All right, guys, so after the minute, we're going to check on our potatoes, make sure that they're fully cooked. You can see they're nice and soft. So at this point, we're going to add our eggs. We're just going to move everything around. And I'm adding eight eggs. Start mixing them. Okay, so just mix it. Okay, now we're just going to cook everything together. Alrighty guys, and after five minutes, our machaca is ready. So now we're just going to cover it and set it to the side. And meanwhile, we can fry our beans. Okay, so after 30 minutes, we're just going to release all of the leftover steam. Okay, so once we get rid of all of the steam, we're going to open it. Okay, so now we have our beans ready to fry them. Okay, so now I'm going to get my skillet set it on medium heat. And to that, I'm going to add a little bit of oil, but of course you can use lard. And once that's hot, we're going to add our beans. And I'm only gonna season my beans with salt and black pepper. Just because we want all of the flavor from the machaca. And since our beans are nice and hot, they're ready to be smashed. So get your bean smasher and smash. Okay, so once we have our beans all nice and smashed, now we are ready to add our queso Oaxaca. And you add as much as you want. Just going to mix it and allow the cheese to melt. Okay, and once the cheese melts, our beans are ready. So now we are ready for the fun part. Alrighty guys, and now for the fun part, making our burritos. So here I have my flour tortillas. I made them earlier today because homemade always better. So now I'm just going to start by spreading my beans. Just place them in the center. And you add as much as you want. I'm going to add our machaca and eggs. Okay. And I'm also going to add some salsa verde. And I already have a recipe for the tortillas and the salsa. I will leave them in the description down below. 
we're going to grab the ends and roll. Tuck it in. And roll. Just like that. And just like that, now we are ready to enjoy our delicious machaca egg burritos. Alrighty guys, and now for the best part, the taste test. Now let me tell you guys that I hope you give this recipe a try. It's seriously super easy to make, so flavorful, so delicious. And the best part is that you can stretch it out. So cheers and enjoy. Seriously, it's super delicious. So flavorful. And the tortillas, the beans, everything is just perfection. So good. Alrighty guys, and there you have it on how I make some delicious machaca breakfast burritos. I hope you guys had enjoyed watching this video. And if you did, please don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Share with your friends and family. And if you recreate this recipe, please don't forget to tag me in any of my social medias. And if you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button so you guys can be part of our family. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.